Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 5 of season 2 of The Ancient Magnus Brides. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. So, thank God, after restarting my computer and my Wi-Fi, it's not working again. So, I am going to be very busy for the rest of the night. Which means tonight and tomorrow. But that's okay. I like being busy. I want to take a nap. I'm like, I'm running on like five hours of sleep. That's not good. So, I, and I've tweeted about this before. So, you know, okay. <laughs> you know any picture of Bochi where she looks tired as fuck? That's me. Inside, but on the outside, I look like Kida. Where she's just so happy, happy, joy, joy. But I am so tired. I am dead inside. I want to go to sleep. But I can't go to sleep yet. I gotta get so many things done before I can go to sleep. And I'm kind of hungry, too. Good thing I went to the store. Yeah. Sucks. Okay, you want to talk about it? <laughs> I mean, yeah, I get that, but still, you were on the phone and don't want to be rude. Oh my god, you ain't got to be a bitch 24 7. She just being nice. Have you not met a nice person before? Ugh. See, my thing about Lucy is, hold on. Mm. Okay. I feel like she used to be nice. Probably very nice. You know how, like, sometimes you walk all over the nicest person in the world, you know, and I've had that happen to me. Um... that it's to a point where you're, you're just tired of being nice and you just want to be a bitch. Yeah, she just seems like a person who used to be nice and people walked all over her and used her and I think she got tired of that. I mean, yes, she is. Also, she's a loner type. Better try to do. Hold up, Jasmine, you just opened your mouth. No, 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 no. What the fuck was that? Oh, 
about to, after this episode, I'm about to put that on Twitter. And who, if you if you reply to me, go ahead and spoil me on that. What the heck that means? like a hash brown it's just making me hungry even though i ate at like 12. <laughs> Okay, makes sense. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, well, Jasmine opened her big fat mouth. Yeah. I just want to know why Ivy is being a dick, right? I want him to stop avoiding. Oh, damn. So. What's the problem? Not until you answer the problem. You're avoiding her. It's weird. Um, I want to know, damn it. Okay, so you Medusa son. All right. But nobody ain't instantly turning into stone, though. What are oh
could have at least taken, you know, the headphones or earmuffs, but it's okay. No. So, Lucy, what's the tragedy, baby? Because it has to do with you. You can explain. Hey, you never know what could pop up at this college. We've now learned that. We're on week five of the show. Oh, hell no, nah. it's a maze. That's what a car crap just occur where they got lost in the maze card. This is, I'm getting field stores up. Now I want to rewatch Car Cut to Sakura. <laughs> Again. <laughs> no, no, we just want to talk. Ah. We're just asking questions, that's all. Oh, that sure. Oh, okay. I mean, you know, no, but I, I wasn't thinking it was going to go like that, but okay. No. Oh. 
Maybe. Yeah. Mm hmm. <laughs> no. <laughs> Well, mm, it's a long story. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's okay. Mm -hmm. yeah, you never heard someone say that to you before. Mm hmm Beautiful. Right? Okay, well, you know what? Look at Elios. Because <laughs> he loves you, man. What the hell was that? Phil? Phil. Oh. Nasty, what if she was going to take this information that she just learned about Chise and Ivy and tell what's her face? I think what where her name was Vanessa or something. Oh, that's a lie. Come on now. I mean, it, it seemed like it seems like she has good intentions, but you know, think about it. We've all been fooled by someone before. <laughs> mm -hmm. Why would it be in order? Yeah. I mean, you're friends with her, aren't you? Thing is, hold up. Why ain't y'all close the damn door? Like, still? Hey, are we all cutting our fingers? Oh, hell no. Of course, we're making a blood plaque. Ah, oh, Jesus. Does that mean it worked? Yeah.
Well, I mean, yeah, because it seems like she... Oh. Oh? Was that the worst return? Was that a tragedy? You know, you can answer. If I'm right, like, if it's yes, I'll blink twice. If it's no, I'll blink once. Just give me an answer. <laughs> I get that, but still. You, you now gave us something that I want questions on. I ain't gonna kiss, are you? Okay. Questions on my questions on my questions on my questions. So once again, what the fuck is the Webster tragedy? What also happened to Lucy's family? Because I'm guessing, of course, everybody must have died. And it's also because of Bill's family. So I'm guessing that's also the reason on why Lucy hates Phil. Um, the twins in the image, like, I, I don't think they're not like, you know, he get her and Cowder from Oran, okay? They they're just they are close, I get it, but they're not to the point. They kind of give you the feels towards those two, but not really. It's just they don't go that far and do it. Thank God, or like any other type of anime that has done that. And I'm over here like, that really happened right now, didn't it? But okay, Ivy, like I was not expecting for all that to happen in today's episode. And then, you know, everyone's sharing, and then now we're making a pact, and if you say something, you get yeeted. Okay. All right, just, I need to know on that. But you know what, let me let me go ahead and tweet this-ish. Be like, mm, okay, who just texted me? I'll look at that later. I have a question. What is the Webster tragedy? <laughs> I just finished the episode and I need to know. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna look at that preview one more time real quick. So go back to the end. Go right there. <laughs> okay so i mean but yeah th this episode was really interesting i love the fact that you know we got to learn more about ivy and his situation because i never would have thought that you know he would have been that but i mean d should we really be surprised she says like going to a college where like pretty much anybody is not human anyone could be anything you're going to a magical freaking college, so anyone could be anything, regardless. So come on now, don't be surprised about that. Um, but I want to talk a little bit more about Phil real quick. I, I just I feel like because I, I've liked her ever since we met her, but because if her because I think her name is Vanessa, she has this control over her or this dominance over Phil that. 
it just feels like in that moment when she is quote unquote spying on Chise and the rest of them, it seems like she was going to take the information that she learned about Ivy and Chise and, you know, tell her and such. And I feel like because Phil is also one of those characters who has been stepped on for being too shy, nice, whatever, um, she has not really essentially talked about her feelings or truly you know like come out of her shell or she she's still trying even at this age and so I feel like with the help of Lucy and she say I feel like when she says in Lucy because Lucy is feeling some type of way about this girl because she's like you know it's because of you my family died and I'm like okay we can't be friends I'm just saying all right end of story period point blank mm. um but I do hope that the backstory on those two eventually gets answered in the next coming weeks because I think like what by next week we'll be at the halfway point of this show and anything can truly happen with these characters and such so we now have immediately even a thousand more unanswered questions still downstairs in episode what two or three that door that that part those two people went into now the Webster tragedy there's still so many things it's like okay how are you going to get this all answered in the next six weeks before this show is is over and so I feel like can they do that I don't know and this is also going to be the time of maybe Tisha should just go ahead and just read the tank manga and such because you know curious what to know I need answers but I think I probably won't do that until we get to the end of this I mean because I was like that when season one came out where I think by the time we were done I heavily wanted to read but because I got so busy with like all these other shows and at the same time still looking for a job and even now I am still extremely busy between this and work um I feel like I just don't have time, but who knows? I might have time, you never freaking know, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode five of season two of The Ancient Magnus Spine. If you guys enjoyed it, uh, I can speak. <laughs> please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel, I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode six. Bye, guys.